Another important node in a Gaia is a file node. In a file node, you can import your own height map black and white image. This. Now, as you can see, we have a height map. This software is exporting height map, but if you have a very quality and nice height map, you can create this mount, this the mountain by this height map. Now, as you can see, the <clears throat> The white area is the peak of that mine, the mountain, and the gray is coming down to the black. It means it's a base, a surface, the zero uh, height of your image. This is on a height map, and you can insert it here. It's very simple in the settings. Browse the file, and boom. And as you can see, this is our mountain from that height interesting and then you can work with with it and combine with other nodes so you learn how to import your height map but let's explore the settings save as a relative pass first we have to save your file and then it save this pass beside your file it's very important when you want to sharing the file the tor file and as you can see the tor file with the, this file because you want to share it because the software always need that file to creating the mountain for you the scale is very important how to calculate the scale we have three uh, choose raw raw setting it means it uh, respect the data from your height map and transfer it to the height in this software it means it does not um, change the height uh, information in this image raw normalize if you want to uh, uh, normalize here in a normalize uh, sorry in a normalize it's um, insert the the height map data to match the height and the scale data in a Gaia. It changed the data information you height to match the Gaia setting. That you can see it's not that's not correct. That you have to clamp it if you want. Nice. You can use the clamp if you want. Some cases, if you want to change the height, you can use it. Another thing is a remap. In a remap, that is the same to the raw, it's try to match the settings in a train definition here. So in most cases, please use a raw. You insert exact height data in your created height map that you insert this. I want to exactly import it. If, but if you want, you can change the uh, it normalize. It means it's created Gaia settings, remap, it's created in the build setting. That you can change it in a uh, clamp if you want. Anyway, if you want, you can use uh, height quality scaling. If you tick that, it's you, you can make sure that all of the details from your height map is imported. But uh, be careful about the speed. It reduces the speed very, very much. Treat as an RGB. Now, as you can see, it's gone because it's changed. It's insert your image as a colored image, not black and white. Because we need a black and white. The software knows the black. And in some cases, it's useful. And it enforces the linear gamma for your image if you want. Or if you have an EXR file, you can activate it. But I'm sure that I have a PNG, JPEG. Okay, this is an import file and you can use this mountain. And here you can remote or rename it instead of file, cell, cell, for example, heal, anything that you want, you can rename it here and use it in the combined with other nodes so as you can see we have a lot of nodes, nodes here hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us
like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release